European Union countries approved a weakened emergency plan to curb their gas demand on Tuesday. It comes after striking compromise deals to limit the cuts for some countries as they brace for further Russian reductions in supply. Energy ministers approved a proposal for all EU countries to voluntarily cut gas use by 15 percent from August to March. I think it's an important, very important next step. It shows that Europe stays united, that Europe is able to find uni uni unity and um, giving a strong signal also um, in the day where the flows of gas in Nord Stream 1 are reduced to another 20 percent. Uh, to Putin and to Russia, uh, you won't split us. Several EU countries are already facing reduced Russian supplies. Brussels is urging member states to save gas and store it for winter for fear Russia will completely cut off flows in retaliation for Western sanctions over its war with Ukraine. The cuts could be made binding in a supply emergency, but countries agreed to exempt numerous countries and industries after some governments had resisted the EU's original proposal to impose a binding 15 percent cut on every country. Russia's Gazprom has blamed its latest reduction on needing to halt the operation of a turbine, a reason dismissed by the EU. We know that uh, there is no technical reason to do so. This is a uh, politically motivated step and we have to be ready for that and exactly for that reason the preemptive reduction of our gas demand is a, a wise uh, strategy.